I'm Tara with Tara Simon Studios, and today for the first time, I'm going to be reacting to Connor Maynard singing Alan Walker's Faded. If you haven't done so already, you know what I'm about to say. Subscribe to this channel. Click the notifications button. What you waiting for? Let's do this. The shadow to my light Did you see us? Gorgeous Another star You fade away mm. Afraid I ain't as out of sight Wanna nice see cry. us Alive Where are you now? So you hear how he's going Where are you now? So there's a little blip there from chest into head. It's a really great stylistic choice that he's doing. Um, and this is very indicative of that pop style, especially uh, in reference to like acoustic covers when you're adding some sort of little extra something, something that maybe wasn't there in the original. Really good job so far. Ooh, where are you now? Did it again. Oh, yes, he's doing where all in the place. Are you now? Was it all in my fantasy? Where are you now? Also what he's doing, so just so you guys know, because there's a lot, there's gonna be a lot of like stylistic choices in this, I can tell already. So when he goes, where are you now? The A for the R, he's choosing to do a glottal attack now. That, now normally you wouldn't necessarily want to do glottal attacks all the time. It costs you a little bit more vocal dollars. And if you don't know what vo vocal dollars is, check out the description box below and get into my Sing Smarter Not Harder eight week course you'll thank me later for it. But moving on, if you're doing a glottal attack, where ah uh, ah, uh, the chords are slapping together, then rubbing, versus if you connect where and are with no stop in between, they're just rubbing. Where are you now? Versus where are you now? Right, but it's cool because it adds style. It adds this sort of like grit and intensity and, and um, percussiveness to the voice when you do that. So I'm not knocking it. I just want you guys to know what he's doing so that maybe if you wanted to do it in a song, you can do it too. Will you only imagine are you all vocal fry? Where are you now? Just ahead. That's also really cool too. I'm sorry I'm stopping so much, but there's so much vocal stuff in here to talk about. When he goes, under, under, uh. So slow-mo, what he's doing there is he's going chest, head, breath. Duh. You hear the So what I'm doing is I'm pushing forward into chest and then I'm releasing the push and I'm keeping the intensity of the breath. Okay, so see if you can do it. Duh. So as I'm doing chest, the same amount of breath that's coming out for me to be able to do chest stays spinning forward and out of my mouth. But the but the intensity and the effort that I'm putting in to do chest when I want to go into head gets pulled back with the same amount of breath as if I were doing chest coming out. And that's what creates that sound. Under, under. You can you guys do it? Try it. Under. That's exactly what he did there. I'm with a different girl Who woulda knew that life could be a lonely world I'm reminiscing, missing everything we were So I could be with you, but I still think of her It's crazy how we don't even talk And I still think of you in every single place that I walk In my home, in my city, I guess you left a mark Ain't it funny how you miss the brightest times when it's dark But I love the love of my life just turned into anonymous So now you're a stranger that I don't wanna miss A stranger with all the clothes in my laundry bin mm. All of her dresses, sweaters, and cards Against. Mm. I should throw them out, I should just forget it The past can only hurt you if you let it True. But I let it, cause I'm still about you Life is fucking crazy, but it's crazier without you Where are you now? 
I love that grit, that rasp in his voice and Connor's voice. that I would change so far about this entire performance is how he's saying the vowel on faded because I've talked about this before like if you're gonna be a certain character in a song like if you're gonna choose a certain style and if you're gonna choose to produce a vowel in a certain way I would rather you continue that throughout the song and so this whole time he's done I'm faded dead d almost like you're dead d-e-a-d -E right dead um, but this time he goes, I'm faded, I'm faded, faded, D-I-D, instead of D-E-A-D. And I think it probably would have been easier on him, cost him less vocal dollars, not that it's a hard note for him, but still we're being, you know, greedy with our vocal dollars. And I think it would have been more powerful if he did, I'm faded, faded. I think it would have also allowed him to have a little bit more stylistic, um, enunciation vocally there if he had a more open mouth on the dead and kept it congruent with how he started to produce that dead vowel from faded all the way up until this point and the song's almost over so um, let's listen back so you can hear what I'm talking about when he's doing the faster faded instead of faded I'm so faded, faded. It. No resolution, like it. Yeah, that's kind of like my favorite way to end a song, by the way, just in case you didn't know. Uh, Connor Maynard, guys, my first time hearing him or reacting to him, because you know I live under a vocal coaching rock. And if it weren't for you, I wouldn't know any of these people. So thank you so much for asking me to react to Connor and his cover of Faded. It was very, very good. Um, so rich in vocal style. And I hope that I was able to kind of break down in a tangible and actionable way for you guys how to do some of the things that he did so beautifully in his cover. Uh, make sure if you haven't already, like I said at the beginning, subscribe to the channel. Check out the description box below. There are all sorts of amazing links to help you or someone you know or love on your or their vocal journey. And most importantly, guys, make sure that you spread faith, not fear. Yeah, not fear. Uh, love, not germs. And be a blessing in a stranger's life because you know it. Say it with me. That is how we change the world. I love you guys. I am proud of you. And I'll see you on the next one. So now you're here again, knocking at my door. A little too late for, I'm sorry for. The lights went out cause you kept cutting the cord And it started to fade into your grave See I finally opened up my eyes